Oh, gosh. The train does move. No way. Oh, my gosh. It's like flying away. I've broken the train. What's up, dudes? It's Ezigo. And today, Zach Blake here. And today, we're using banned hands in Poppy Playtime Chapter 2. That's right. Today, I tried to think of the most craziest ideas for the most dangerous hands possible. I even combined it with your guys' ideas. And I sent it to my personal modern buddy, Kokosko, to see if he can turn all of these ideas into usable powers and contraptions for the grab packs. And it's been a while, but these are the hands right here and they look so amazing they're on little cranes i'm excited i think some of them teleport some of them come to life some of them slow down time there's a nightmare one i think this is gonna get intense but uh before we start also i wanted to give a little update of my broken arm uh, you know post surgery with the scar and everything i think you could barely see it but uh yeah it's it's feeling good i think i can kind of move it mostly now it's nice i feel like i almost do an update every single time we do a hand mod because it's broken hands also i'm feeling sick so i'm pushing through it so my voice cracks don't make fun of me too much <laughs> Nevertheless, I'm excited because I think that these are going to get pretty and, oh gosh, insane. Whoa, they all come down. Jeez, honestly, I don't know how Kokosko does this every time. He keeps blowing my mind. Like, I don't know. I feel like this little thing just adds so much. So uh, I think I kind of want to start here because this looks like the nightmare hand. I, I, I gave him an idea for a hand that was so crazy that it would cause nightmares. And if you're thinking about the lore of like Playtime Co., if they're doing experiments, they're trying the craziest experiments, this could be one of them. And if this was a banned hand, it must be insane. So uh, I hope... I hope that Kokosko did it. I don't know if this is even it. It looks like an electric hand too, so who knows? All right, so let's test this one out in three, two, one. Okay, oh my gosh, it is. It's a nightmare hand. Oh, it's supposed to summon like smoke and it makes, it induces nightmares and you can see eyes. Oh, no. Oh, okay. Oh gosh. Yeah, I, I feel like I'm seeing eyes everywhere. Oh gosh, no, no. Oh, oh no. Oh, okay. No, I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't like this. All right, just, uh, let's just look at the ground. Nothing's there. Nothing's going on. This is a normal, normal day. Oh, oh, okay. So, um, there are eyes everywhere and they're all just staring. What would be the point of this hand? It only induces nightmares in the people that are using it. So maybe that's why it's banned. I could see this, like if there was a story behind it, it's like the users would go insane. The experiments went wrong. They were testing out crazy uses of hands, but it went uh, wrong against the own user and destroyed their mind. You know what? I'm not even scared. These eyes are my new friends. Hi, how's it going? What's, oh, I maybe should not have used it again. Oh, great, 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 great. So now we have double the eyes staring at us. Hi, everybody. Thank you for looking at me here today. Oh my gosh. All right, I had to restart the game. It was getting too intense. I had to I had to just uh, make sure we had a fresh slate for the next one. So this next one has hands running all over it. And I think this is the idea that I gave him. I, I, I was thinking of an idea for a hand that was so intense that it would pop off and become its own entity. A hand that came to life and destroyed everything. Everything. So I'm thinking that this one is it. We can call the hand like Zool, the evil hand. So uh, I'm thinking that that's what this is. I feel like I would be, uh, I'd be kind of embarrassed if I just described a hand that didn't do that power, but I'm kind of sure. So um, I guess let's see what this hand does in three, two, one, go. Okay. Oh gosh. Oh, it just spawns it. Oh my gosh. Hey, 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 hey. Calm down. Calm down. Calm. Oh no, I just, I pushed him forward. Oh, okay. But look at him. He's like lasering everything. I mean, no wonder this one would be banned. It probably would go around destroying the, oh, I mean, it is going around destroying the factory, but you know what? I, I'm, I'm for it. I'm, I'm with him. He's kind of adorable. Look at him. He's going around. He's doing what I would do, but just he's flopping around with it. <laughs> I don't know why that's so funny to me. Look at him. Ah, oh, he's just moving around. Can I make another one? Oh, look at Oh, they look like they're playing together. Oh my gosh. Come on, laser more stuff. No, don't give up on the lasers. Can I stand on top of him? Hold on. I can't. No. No, don't don't die. Ah, don't smack me. Jeez. Okay. Well, gosh. They're not lasering anything anymore, which is I guess kind of oh, nope, there there it is. He just He's starting explosions. Well, so far, this is already really intense. I mean, these hands, every single one of them has been the craziest one so far. So how can it even get topped with this one? I mean, Zool, the evil hand, what, what tops that? So this one looks crazy. I think Kokosko was telling me about, oh, I see it. There's like, it looks like a clock. 
Is this the slow motion hand? So, oh, it is. Oh, I could see it. There's like, um, what is it? The hands of a clock. He said he figured out a way to freeze time, but make it so that the player could still move around. I don't know how I would use this. Um, maybe... Maybe we can summon something. Maybe we summon a bunch of mommy long legs, have them chase us, and then we'll walk around uh, and, and see if we could just outrun them. All right, I've summoned five of mommy long legs. You know, who's supposed to be the crazy evil villain, but I feel like we've modded the game so much now that she kind of just looks adorable. Look at her, look at that adorable face. Come and chase me. I think I have to press B on my keyboard and then they all, okay, yeah, here we go. And boom, slow motion. Oh. Gosh, whoa. Oh, and I could walk around all normally. Look at that. That is so cool. All right, let's duck under the laser here. Okay. And the hand, the hand, the Zool hand is now lasering Mommy Longlegs. Oh my gosh, wait a minute. Mommy Longlegs is getting shrunk and destroyed. Dude, the hand, that is so crazy. Wow, it's almost relaxing. We're walking around while everything else is in slow motion. We're just kind of like looking at things happen. The hand is moving. The mommy long legs is just chasing us. We should use this later in the game. We could use this hand to kind of just be like, and we're running away. <laughs> oh wait, oh my gosh. Look, she's shrinking. The hand is shrinking mommy long legs. Oh gosh, she just exploded. Well, uh, thanks to the hand, we have uh, nothing to worry about. So that is, that's great. Okay, too much fire in my face. Can I speed up time now? Oh yeah, it's back. Wow. So then what is this one? Is this the teleport hand? It's just so magical to see these come down and we could use all of these. Uh, we're unlocking them all right now. So later we can use them in the uh, actual game and go throughout different like saves of the game and check it out. So I think this is the one he was telling me was a uh, teleport hand. I think this was like a lot of your guys' suggestions was a hand that could teleport you randomly throughout the factory. And I think it, what it's supposed to do is you just click the ground, it'll teleport you. And then wherever you go, it'll kind of just be like an explosion. It'll clear everything out and teleport you somewhere random. So uh, I'm excited. This one is probably the most suggested in, so let's just see what it does in three, two, one, boop. and uh, okay, oh gosh, uh, it teleported me just like a few feet over, but you do you see those effects. Hold on, let's try it again. So it's like if we were running for mommy long legs or even a future boss, we we'll just go like this, and it's like, all right, here we go, see you later. Whoa, oh wait, no, 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 it teleported me somewhere else. What it teleported me underground. What? What? How does Cocos Go do this? It honestly just feels like, like we're getting a whole new game. I've been like so surprised at how crazy all this is. I'm like losing my voice. Oh man, I'm excited. So this one, I think, I think we've eliminated everything. This might be the funny hand. So in the last uh, hands episode, there was this like metal hand that all it did was fall over. Literally you used it and would go plop and just fall over. But now I think this is the wooden hand. So with the uh, wooden hand, I have no idea what it does. Maybe it just does nothing. It does kind of look good. So hold on. We're just going to do that. And uh, uh, nothing. Nothing happens. Also, I think it's a little bit of a glitch because when I use it, I see the blue hand, but then it comes back and it's like the wooden hand. And it just like jiggles. Do you see it? It goes broop, broop. <laughs> but um, I think, oh, oh yeah. That giant pipe just fell. I think that the wooden hand just makes everything fall over. <laughs> Wait, so I could just make everything fall over? <laughs> No. I don't know why, but that's like just the most simple mod uh, for a hand that it just feels so beautiful. Look at that. We're just breaking all the fences. But all of this does is just make things, uh, I guess, have physics. Does it work? Oh, gosh, it works on that. Okay, so it breaks everything. I mean, maybe this is more powerful than I thought. Look at that. Oh, man, it's even lagging the game out. So I can even make walls have physics. Hold on. Uh, maybe it doesn't work on everything, but, uh, yeah, wow. Uh, that is crazy to see, though. The factory is falling apart with a wooden hand, the joke hand. The joke hand is making everything fall apart. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Yeah, this could be the most powerful. Nah, you know, this is not the most powerful hand. The most powerful hand was the last, uh, hands mod, the elemental hands mod, the explosion hand. That one was crazy, but... Maybe this could glitch out the game. If I do it on the train, what happens? Does the train move? Oh, okay. Well, it, it moves the train's wheels. Uh, the, the wheels are, they're leaving. Uh, hello? Hello? Oh gosh, the train does move. No way. Oh my gosh. It's like flying away. I've broken the train. <laughs> can I do it on this? Oh, 
the door is is gone. Oh, but it's kind of stuck. Oh, there it goes. It just flopped out. So with uh, floating trains, we got crazy hands. I want to see if we can use these uh, in different parts of the game because these are really fun. So now for even future mods, I think we have them unlocked. Oh yeah, there it is. Wooden teleport time monster and nightmare. Oh, so the monster was the, uh, what is it we call them? Zool, the hand. What if you have two nightmare hands? Does that just break the game? All right, nightmares are happening. Here they go. Gosh. That just feels like the coolest one. It just makes you like realize like what could be possible in this game. I mean, it's kind of just like scary. You could just hear, you know, I like imagine sounds of like laughter in the distance and you see eyes going crazy. Just imagine scientists writing down like, subject seems to be going insane. We don't see anything, but uh, maybe these hands shouldn't be allowed. But uh, we also could break the game with the monster hands. Like you could just spawn in a bunch of it and just see what happens. All right, go my minions. Go and destroy the factory. Live, be free. They kind of just look like little flopping like turtles almost. They're just kind of moving forward. Some of them are lasering things, but the other ones, oh look, those are hanging out. They gave each other high fives. Oh, that's cool. Oh man, this is great. Who would have thought that you would, uh, see a point of the game where there were moving hands crawling around destroying everything all right the game is getting a little laggy so maybe we just jump to a different part of the game all right so i jumped to my favorite part of the game where mommy long legs wants us to play hide and seek but today i want to freeze time so let's see if that's possible let's get the time hands so with this what really happens because um I think that if it slows down time, does she still move? It's like an animation. Ah, okay, so let's do it. Three, two, one, boop, and oh, she doesn't stop. She doesn't stop moving. Um, no, time, time, time. I think it's because she's a pre-rendered cutscene. Uh, nothing happens, huh? Okay, so here's my idea. She's counting down right now. Uh, I'm gonna see what happens if I do it. So three, two. Okay, does it work? No, it doesn't. She just defies the laws of physics. I swear if Wooden could beat her, I don't I don't think Wooden will. But uh let's let's see. The monster one? Ooh. Or what about teleport? Okay, the teleport definitely I think could save us. Uh but let's test uh, test out these. So, for some reason, Wooden doesn't work. I click Wooden for both of my hands and the game's like, "No, that's you can't can't use the most powerful hand." wooden hands <laughs> for some reason it doesn't work i don't know what to do uh but i guess um let's test uh, the other one all right uh so monster does monster work on her go all right and go go gosh why is he so much bigger all right i need your help go go tool delete her go get her stop looking like you're running away no oh my gosh uh yeah it's it's not really helping. Please. No, no. It's adorable. It looks like he's trying, but um, it's not working. Yeah, she's going to get me. Come on, just get out of here, hand. She's going to... Uh, come on. Come on. Let's make it happen if you know. Yep, she got me. All right, so I spawned in the wooden hand here, and I think, okay, now I can get it to work. Let's see if it works now. Uh, let's just do this, and go. No, work, work, work. No, 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 no. All right, nothing's working. I think we can just do this. All right, wait, wait. Maybe I can do it now. Uh, uh, I'll get the uh, teleport hand, teleport hand, teleport hand. Go and teleport. Teleport me somewhere else, please. Oh, okay, not there, not there, not there, not under. And we lost. I guess you can kind of see why these would be banned hands because none of these hands actually work. They're just kind of like a detriment to whoever uses them, right? But I guess uh, that's what makes them fun. You know, all right. Uh, I have nightmare and teleport now, so let's just see what happens. And uh, so I'm teleporting and I'm summoning nightmares. Ah, where am I? Where am I? Where am I? Oh, oh, oh! I just teleported somewhere really random. Oh, it's like way down there. Okay, so I, I think we're good now. I think we're safe. So she's counting down. We see eyes. Oh gosh. Okay. She's counting three, two, nothing. We did it. Now, can I teleport again? I forgot which one is teleport. Is it this one? Is this teleport? Oh, yep, yep, yep. That, that teleported me really random. I'm almost on top of the pipe over there. Oh, I used the teleport again and I'm back up here. And I think she's gone. Wow, these hands are crazy. They just feel really fun to use. 
They're just really crazy and random, you know? And with all like the effects, it just feels really nice. Well, I guess we tested out everything. I don't know if they would really change wherever we go. I was thinking maybe we go to like the ending, but I'm thinking it's the same thing. If I just teleport, I'm teleporting out of there, you know? But I guess out of all of these, which ones would you want to use the most? I feel like almost the wooden hand. <laughs> the wooden hand is almost my favorite out of all of these. But that's kind of how it works because I feel like my humor is so bad. The last mod, the metal hand that just fell over, that was my favorite. <laughs> but uh, nevertheless, I think I'm going to leave it here. Uh, tell me what you guys think. If you guys have any new ideas for hands, maybe we can make even an, even more, you know? What are the craziest hand powers that are possible? But hopefully I made you smile because that's all I want to do every single day. So if you're ever feeling bad, you can look up Dak Blake. We can play some games and I could cheer you up once more. So thank you guys for subscribing as we go on to 2 million subscribers. I thank God every day that I'm able to do things like this to just kind of like mess around in games, use mods, play things differently and all just to make you smile. So, you know, uh, hopefully I will see you in the next episode. Probably coming up right now. I'll see you there. Thank you guys for watching. And as always, peace out, my dudes.